Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. I remember in 2012 there was a shortage of ammo, a shortage of guns, especially rifles and eventually handguns, any supplies people needed, magazines were hard to find and it was a tough time to be a gun owner. And at that time there were people that were hoarding, there were companies that were charging a little more but none greater than cheaper than dirt. They were selling P-Mags for $80 and many people were upset with them they said i will never spend another dime there that's the way they treat their customers and that is horrible and i agreed with that you know people were upcharging more companies were upcharging three four dollars because of supply and demand and not many people had a problem with that they would sell them until they sold out and that was that and they did sell out but not cheaper than dirt they started selling these for eighty dollars and then we flash forward to now we see panic buying again people are buying up everything they need they they are um i don't know so much hoarding i'm sure that's going on to a degree but these online sites the local gun stores they are packed the people are buying up everything because they are nervous of what the future holds and that is completely understandable but don't you notice when times are slow, these companies, they, they try to feed out their, you know, these deals that are going on. They say, hey, get these while you can, you know, hey, special sale here. And many gun owners are loyal to those companies. We buy from the place that we feel comfortable with, places that have treated us well, and we, we help them out during the slow times. And then when times get tight like this, when ammo is hard to find, when certain products you want are hide, hard to find, who but cheaper than dirt, the disgraced company that they are, skyrocket their prices once again. And I think what they're doing is horrible. If you look at their site, they are selling 556 five, and, and 223 a dollar around, $45 for a box of 380, $20 for a box of 20 to 25 30 dollars for a box of nine millimeter now i don't have a problem with anybody making a profit i think that's good for the company it's good for the gun industry and it's good for us we want these people to be successful but when i see gouging from the very people who claim to be pro two-way a company like cheaper than dirt who is at it again and they'll make their money They'll make their money doing this. There'll be people that'll panic buy and, and, you know, they may be low on something and say, I'll pay any price just to get my hands on it. But the long-term effects is what Cheaper Than Dirt is going to have to endure. When they do this and they, they are consistently doing this, saying, you know, when, when things get tight, instead of saying, hey, we, we want to return the loyalty back to you as our customers, no, they jack it up, and that company is a disgrace. I think they, they should be boycotted. I have not spent a dime there since 2012. I'm certainly not going to do it now. I think that when they run their sales and say, we are, we offer our products cheaper than dirt, they're actually a ripoff company. They're an opportunist, and they are not friends of the gun industry. Well, they may be friends of their own gun industry, but not friends of gun owners, and their loyalty lacks big time. Now, I checked Target Sports USA. I checked Midway USA. I checked other ones just to make sure and they are right in line with what they were. Maybe a dollar or two more given that, you know, it's it's a time, you know, unfortunately times like this is great for the gun business. It's not great for us, but it's great for the gun business. And I understand that, but they may raise it a dollar or two just because it's an opportune time to, to make some cash. Some of these com companies are very much hurting in the summer months when things are slow not cheaper than dirt they they they're not making a dollar or two they are making over a hundred percent on their ammo prices and they are outrageous and i ha i want nothing to do with cheaper than dirt i think their true colors are showing again and they don't deserve any of our money whether times are plentiful or times are rare cheaper than dirt is anti-2a if you like videos like this please subscribe and share I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.